freaking heat. I'm just gonna adjust that. But... What's up? What's up? How y'all doing? Hey guys, what's up? How y'all doing? Right, let me get the right angles for this. Perfect. Right. Wagwan, hey Emil, what's up everyone? PT Legend, cheers Yash. What's going on? Hey buddy, how you doing? Who is ready to work out? Why don't you train? Ugh. Good questions, come on. Can you give me a shout out? Hey TX, how you doing? Hey Sideman, best man, how you doing? Right, who is ready to work out? Sort of did. Hey, IG Footy Sport, if you're into football, follow them. 15 squats go. We'll do some squatting in a bit. Me, I'm ready. Steph is ready. Water at the ready. Good stuff. Shout me out, TJ Canton. All right, guys, we're going to warm up now. So let's get into position. So like we did last time, we're just going to rotate the arms. And we're just going to go at good speed. You can do that 10 times. And then just increase the speed. What that does, it just warms up the upper body. And then we're going to go anti-clockwise. And just pick up the pace a bit so that you warm up that body. Need to get that body ready for the main workout. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay. The next one, we're just gonna open up the hips. Hips are very important. You need to loosen them up. So we're just gonna loosen up like so. One, two, and then back up. Two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Just open those hips up. They're very prone to injury, so you just want to make sure they're ready. One, two, open them up. One, two, one, two. This is called closing the gate. If any of you play football, you'd have done this just before a match. Do 10 of these, and what you're gonna do now is just bring it back in. I think this is close the gate. Yeah, this is closing the gate. The other one was opening the gate. My bad. You can always get things mixed up whilst you're working out. Make sure you've got water ready on the side so you can take some sips of it. And just do 10 of them. Two, one, and the next one, we're just gonna do kick outs. What that does, just gets the hamstrings ready. Then warm ups to get the body ready for the workout ahead. Just do 10 of these. Three, two, one, and that's it. Next one, what we're gonna do is we're gonna lunge in and we're just gonna rotate the core both ways and then back out and then back in, rotate, back in. We're just gonna do 10 of these. And then back up, back in. Make sure you don't lose your stability. It's all on the ankles. Make sure everything's deep enough. And then back out. I'm starting to lose mine. That's it. And then change all the way in and out. It's all about the ankles. If you get them stable enough, everything should be cool. And we've just got three more of these. So you can go to eight to 10 reps. Last two, and last one. And then my favorite, the scapula press. We're just gonna get to the floor. We're just gonna drop sort of back bit of your shoulders, which is called the scapula. Make sure our arms are straight. Just drop that down and just go for 10, nine, eight, seven. Just count it down in your head, 
four, three, two, one. As you can see, I'm warmed up and ready, I'm sweating. And uh, what I'm gonna do, if you guys wanna do that as well, just open up a window, because it can get hot. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay, I'm gonna do like five exercises. And uh, what we're gonna do now is, yeah, we're gonna go through five exercises, three sets of them. And that should be a great workout. Okay, first one we're gonna do, is we're gonna do lateral lunges or side lunges. Gonna be in a sensor position. And we're just gonna go down, like so. And again, that's my door slamming. Two, side to side, I'll step back so you can see me. Four, five, six, seven, three, two, and one. And that's our 10. Next one, it's a bit more high intensity. What we're gonna do is we're gonna jog on the spot. We're just gonna lift our knees up as high as possible. And we're just gonna go for 30 seconds. 30 seconds of these. So I'm counting in my head. So you, you guys should be as well. That's it, just keep going. And with that, we're upping our heart rate and we're burning loads of calories. Last 15 seconds. 10. That's it, keep going guys. Six, five, four, three, two, one, and relax. What we're gonna do now is we're gonna go to the floor and do shoulder taps. So you want everything to be straight, core to be straight. Don't pivot too much. You wanna stabilize that core. What that does, it just works to stay the shoulders as well as your core. We're gonna do 20 of these. Make sure you don't move your hips. Stabilize that core. And just to go nice and slow so that the shoulders feel it. Nine, 10, 10 more. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now relax. How are you all feeling? I'm sweating buckets, which is the main purpose of this. If you're sweating a lot, it's working. If you want to get into this position, we're going to do double dip squats. So we're just going to go low and then up. And you want to just double dip like so and then come up. What that does, it just puts the muscles under more uh, stress and increases hypertrophy, which is growth in that region. Three. Seven more, seven, good, six, five, four, three more, two, let's do one more, and that is the fourth exercise, next one, we're gonna do so we're gonna do star jumps another hip based exercise this is just to get the heart rate up and burn more calories so we're gonna go in and out just gonna do 30 seconds of this I'm gonna do 50 reps so do either 50 reps or 30 seconds just keep it going just glide Take deep breaths. Just keep going. That's it, guys. You're doing really good. Keep going. That's it. Go out wide like a starfish. Like a star. And just keep going. 
Keep up in that heart rate. Keep burning those calories. Last 20. Twelve, eleven, ten, nine. That's it, guys. Keep going. Keep pushing through. Three, two, one. Relax. We're just going to rest for a couple of seconds. Take some water and some deep breaths. How are you doing with the exercises? Just so that it gives our body time to rest before we jump in to the next set. And then we can go harder, we can burn more calories. Send off a bit more waves. So here normally we take um, sort of a minute or two just to acclimatize. If you guys aren't ready to go back into the session again, then that's all right. Um, what you can do is you can note down the exercises and then do, do them yourself later on. Oh yeah, some more. Okay, maybe it's warm up north. Good, when you, did you start? Uh, you can start at any point. So we're doing three sets of these. Um, so you can start whenever. Would you recommend water more than Gatorade Parade? To a degree, if you're gonna do an extreme physical workout, then uh, you need your um, electrolytes. So that's when Gatorade and Powerade is really good. Um, if you're just doing a workout like this, then there's nothing better than water. So we're just gonna take a swig of that. That was more than a minute. Uh, right, we're gonna go to the first exercise, which was lateral lunges. We're gonna get into a centered position again. We're just gonna go up like so. And just keep gliding. I'm gonna up it a bit more. I'm gonna do 20 reps instead of the 10. So let's do 20 reps. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now we've got ten more. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Six, five, that's it guys, keep going. Four, three, two, and one. Nice stuff, okay. Gonna go on the floor now, we're we'll gonna do shoulder taps. Just gonna tap, two, three. Remember, we don't wanna move the hips too much. Just wanna control it with our core and our shoulders and really strengthen those two parts. Nice and easy. Good. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Last five, four, three, two, and one more. Nice. Uh, and then what we're going to do now is we're going to jog on the spot. 30 seconds, three, two, one. Let's do the double jumps there. Back, six, seven. So just keep going. If you guys want to follow me, follow me. If you got 30 seconds on the clock, do that. Sit. If we want a good pace, we want everything in sync. That's 10 seconds in my head. <laughs> That's it, keep going guys. We need a good pace. We need to get that heart rate up so we can sweat more, burn more fat. Ten seconds. Ten, nine, eight, five, four, Three, two, one, and relax. Now we're gonna do 
double dip squats. So again, this is to increase the size of your booty or your glutes. What we're gonna do is we're gonna double dip and then come back up. Double dip, come back up. Four, five, six. Just wanna keep it consistent. You wanna go low enough so it's power level or lower. The lower you go, the more size you gain. Four more, last three, two more, and one more, and that's your 10. Now we're gonna do star jumps for 30 seconds. It's gonna go in and out. If you wanna stretch as wide as possible, This is a great workout on the spot. Anyone can do it. Do it in home, as you can see with me. Limited amount of space, then you can do it as well. You can do it in your backyard, front yard, anywhere. And that's the beauty of these workouts. 30 seconds, guys, let's keep going. Last 15. Ten seconds. Ten, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right. All right. I'm using that. Okay. So we said three sets, but I'm gonna up it. We're gonna do four sets. Uh, I can't wave at you guys now. But yeah, we got. Two more sets of these. Got something to dry yourself up. <laughs> well, that's the beauty of these exercises because my door closed, I'm not getting any air in, so I'm sweating a lot, but I still feel good. Um, fitness is good, so I gotta keep going. Um, I will dry myself after, but obviously I'm gonna clean the floor, etc. So we've got two more sets of these. Should I buy your book or app? Uh, get both, really. Um, it's up to you. My app is coming soon so tune in for that uh mustafa if i come to england hope to meet you hope to meet you too brother so yeah we got two more sets of these rest up one minute or two minutes and then get back into it so we're going to get back into the third set we're going to do two more sets i know we said three sets but i feel like this workout deserves four sets so we're going to go in again two more sets go right to the start going to do lateral lunges go in the center again we're just going to go side to side one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We're gonna do 20 of these, 10. So we've got 10 more. 10, nine, eight. So you just wanna get that depth in the squat. You don't wanna push your back up too much. So just get the depth in your squat, so bend your knee a bit more. Stand up right and touch the floor. Five, four, three, two, and one more. That's it. Okay, shoulder taps. We're gonna do 20 of these. Make sure your hands are parallel to your eyes. You don't wanna rotate your hips too much. Keep your strong. Keep your core strong, shoulders strong, and then just reach out. Nine, 10, 10 more, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now we're gonna rise back up. We're gonna do, we're gonna do, Jog on the spot. I'm just gonna do 30 seconds. I'm just gonna keep it going. Just want those 
knees to rise up to your chest and you just want to keep going. All right, last 20 seconds. Just want to keep it going. Keep the pace up. You want to raise that heart rate right up. And you want to burn that fat. Last 10 seconds. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Okay, we're gonna squat with double dips. So every exercise is designed so you guys can complete it with efficiency. So I'm putting the slower, more strength weight, uh, strength body weight exercises in between the hip based exercises, just so you guys can catch your breath, but still maintain that heart rate, which allows you to burn fat. Gonna down, double dip, then back up. Gonna do 10 of these. I have no idea how many I've done, but I'm gonna finish off with five from here. That's what happens when you talk. You lose track of what you're doing, <laughs> especially when you're exercising. Three more, two, last one. Last the last one. Now we're gonna do star jumps. This is a beautiful exercise because everyone can do it and it's not too taxing, but you're raising that heart rate because you're jumping and you're burning a ton of calories. So I'm just gonna do 30 star jumps. You can do 30 seconds. Hey, 27. Keep counting in your head. If you want to count out, that helps, then do that, or just follow me. And when I say stop, stop. Three. So the last 15. So we're halfway, more than halfway there. Last 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, three, two, one. Ooh. That's the third set. We got one more set. I said, guys, keep it going. Whew. Have some water. Get ready for the next one. Let's go. Yes, Daniel. Jackson. Like one more set and that'll finish off the exercise. Truly let us join. I can't. Right, one more set and that's it. We're gonna wrap up. Okay, we're gonna do lateral lunges. So we're gonna be in the center. Just go up like so. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. So the last set, guys, put all your energy into this. Ten. Ten more. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Plus five. Four. Three, two more, two, one. Woo. We're gonna go down to shoulder taps. We're gonna do 20 of these. Make sure you don't move your hips. Control your core, control your shoulders. Five, six, and just count it down in your head. Or just stop when I stop. 10, it's all about the numbers. Last 10, nine, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And we're gonna get back to a standing point. We're just gonna jog on the spot. 30 seconds. 
have a timer in front of you or just count it in your head like I am. Last 20 seconds. Last 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Now we're going to do double dip squats. So we're going to get into a squatting position. And just dip down. One, two. I'm gonna do ten now. I'm gonna count it in my head. Three. Make sure you go parallel or lower. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, last one, nice. Okay, go and get to the last one. You're gonna do star jump. I want you guys to put all your energy towards this and burn as much calories as possible. Just gonna do 30 seconds, just count it in your head or just stop when I stop. This is the last one. So go faster, off the pace. That's it, 20 seconds to go. That's it guys, keep it going. Nearly there. Last 10 seconds. You just wanna go all the way up. Increase the tempo. Five, four, three, two, and relax. Whew. Now's a wrap. Just gonna take a sip of water and then we're gonna cool down. Thanks for the streams. No worries, buddy. Thanks, Dara. Appreciate the love. Right, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna stretch off. No why it's raining so much England. Have a great day, man. Norris. No I'm sweating a lot. Thank you, Dida. Norris. No we did dynamic stretches to start off with. We did a main workout, dripping like a bucket. That's that's what it is, feeling good. Thanks, Steph. Uh, what we're gonna do now, don't leave just yet. We're gonna do a static um, cool down, static stretches, because that's what's gonna get your body <laughs> back to where it was. James is feeling it. I'm sweating, I hope you are as well. I naturally sweat a lot. So what we're gonna do now is get to the floor. We're just gonna stretch those hamstrings up, try and reach far onto your toes and hamstrings. They get a lot of wear and tear, so you want to stretch them out. What that does, uh, basically your muscles are strained and you just want to make them as mobile as possible to avoid injury and stiffness. And then after 10 seconds, so 10 seconds for each stretch, you want to just keep that leg down as much as possible. After 10 seconds, I'm just going to stretch the groins out. Ten seconds. Just want to push your elbows down so you can stretch them off as much as possible for ten seconds. Ten. You just want to push down a bit more. Five, four, three, two, one. Just want to stretch the lower back. So we're going to push our hips all the way down like so. And then just look up. This is a yoga pose. I want to be in this position for 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. And then we're just going to go all the way down, like so. Head to the floor, elbows to the floor. You just want to get your bum towards your heels. Just go for 10 seconds. And what this will do is it will stretch off the upper back as well as parts of your shoulder. It'll be feeling great. Two, one. 
going to go all the way up and then just stretch those triceps for 10 seconds. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And then the other side, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We're just gonna stretch the shoulders off. 10, for 10 seconds again. Six, five, four, three, two, one. And again, all this side. Five, four, three, two, one. And we're gonna come up. We're just gonna rotate shoulders again. Just getting that upper half nice and cooled down. 10 seconds clockwise. Four, three, two, one, and then the other way, anti-clockwise, 10 seconds. Six, five, four, three, two, one. And then just gonna rotate the neck. Nice and slow. We're gonna go clockwise first. And I know some of you are missing out on the stretch, but I tended to do that in the past, but I've learned that it is so essential for recovery. Recovery is the most important thing because it allows you to get ready for the next session, which is very important. Three, two, one, and then the other way. 10 seconds, nice and easy. One and voila, that is it. So we pretty much stretched, um, we pretty much stretched the whole body off and that is the workout. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I'll be putting this on um, YouTube. So if you've missed it out, then you can catch it on YouTube. Hope you guys loved it and uh, I'll catch you later. Peace.